here with Back to Mom. I just wanted to make a quick video um, about a question that I see on the internet a lot, on a lot of forums, and I get asked actually, and that I know lactation consultants get asked as well. And that is, in the process of weaning my nipple shield, can I just cut the tip off? And I'm here to tell you that that's not a good idea. And I know lactation consultants will back me up on this one. And I actually took a nipple shield and I cut the tip off just to kind of show you um, what it looks like. So when you cut silicone, you can't get a real true smooth cut. And not only that, when you cut silicone, and let me show you this, but it leaves sharp edges. So not only is it kind of jagged, it's really hard to cut it smoothly, you can see, um, but it leaves the edges really sharp. And those edges are gonna be uncomfortable against baby's tongue. They're gonna be, you have to think about how many times a baby's tongue rubs over that nipple shield each time they feed, because it's constantly going and going and going. And these sharp edges can do damage to your baby's tongue. They can cause a friction, um, a friction burn or a blister or something like that. They're gonna, it's just gonna cause your baby to be uncomfortable. Not to mention, it can make um, these little jaggedy edges and can leave pieces that can easily come off and be swallowed by baby. And so those are the reason that cutting a nipple shield is bad. When you compare that to our back to mom nipple shields, which are basically the idea of cutting a nipple shield, but they are specially molded and formed so that the edges, and I know it's gonna be hard but the edges are nice and smooth on this. They're rounded. They're not going to cause the baby any kind of friction or rubbing. It's nice and smooth. And all of our shields were specifically designed for that um, with the idea in mind of making sure that there's no discomfort for the baby. So I just wanted to touch on that and explain a little. I know it's a question that gets asked a lot out there. Sometimes when people wean off of bottles or off of uh, binkies they have the same idea and again it's not a good idea as always remember to share this to follow our social media and to tell all your friends about the back to mom nipple shield weaning kit as well as our uh, breastfeeding bite guard and follow any of our blog posts that are out there and help us get into as many um, hands of moms out there that are struggling as possible and from this mom to all you moms out there Thank you so much and we'll see you soon.